All right, we're here with uh, starting pitcher Anthony K. Anthony, career high, uh, nine innings, complete game performance. Uh, what was working for you out there? I was just trying to locate all my pitches, keep them off balance as best as possible, and limit the free 90s. What were you able to do in the third inning you got into trouble in the seventh inning to be able to get out of those jams? Just trying to get a ground ball and get a double play to uh, get out of the inning with one out. First time in a while you've gotten some run support from this offense. Uh, just talk a little bit about that as you had to sit in the dugout a lot. Uh, got some double digits on the scoreboard for you. Feels good to have some run support, you know, being able to give up a couple runs and then you're still winning. It's, it's a good feeling. Thanks, Kay. We're here with uh, first baseman Bobby Melly. Bob, uh, you guys have had a solid series uh, to this point winning the first two games. What does this mean for the ball club to come back after a tough uh, game against Hartford and win the first two? Uh, we know this is one of the teams in our conference. It's one of the best, and we really wanted to come down here and put up a good effort. And uh, first two days have gone well. We've come out out the gates today. Uh, you know, started off real well and just kept on going. Kay gave us the help we needed and shut him down. And uh, that's all you can ask for. We had a great effort all around today. What's been working for you yesterday? Your 21st birthday, three hits for you, and then today, a couple ribbies as well. Uh, just seeing the ball well. I mean, I uh, made a few adjustments, but uh, you know, just seeing it better. You know. Staying a little bit more disciplined, trying to get a pitch I can handle, and uh, you know, just trying to hit the ball hard. And that's really been it the past few days. How do you guys go for the sweep tomorrow and finish this thing off? Uh, I think we got to wash the first two days. I think you know today, even if it was a blowout, it doesn't really mean much. We got to come out tomorrow with great effort and uh, great energy, just like we did today. And hopefully Jordan will go out with those strikes. It's going to keep us in the game, and uh, we're going to do the same offensively. We're here with uh, UConn shortstop Brian Daniello. Brian. Seems like you love to hit at this field. Your first career homer came against Troy. You were able to hit a uh, two-run bomb today. What did you see in that at bat that you were able to drive the baseball? Um, you know, just starting off today, I saw the ball pretty well. I was seeing it clear. Even last night, I was seeing it real well. Um, so coming to the bat, you know, Coach Horgan told me, he said, just get ready to look for that fastball. The kid threw me a off-speed pitch first pitch, but I was, I was waiting for that fastball. And uh, next pitch, you know, he kind of ran it in there a little bit, and I was sitting on it. So I just kept the hands in. And when I hit it, I, I kind of knew it was gone. So it felt good. It felt real good. Talk a little bit about this series for you guys. Tough weekend series last weekend against USF. I know the guys really want to get back into conference play. Win the first two here against a top 15 opponent. Yeah, you know, it's good. You know, especially when you can win a series on a Saturday and go for the sweep on Sunday is what we want to do. So I think, you know, as long as we keep coming out with the same intensity that we had today, if we come out tomorrow, you know, Jordan's going to give us a quality start. As long as we're making the plays behind them and stay aggressive at the play, I think we'll be okay and have a good chance to sweep a top, tw uh, top 25 team. First three-hit game of the season. How's that feel? Felt good. You know, I've had a lot of two-hit ones, but it feels good to finally get the first three-hit one. So, feels good. Just got to keep it going and uh, just keep keep winning games. That's what's important now. So, just got to keep it going. Thank you, Cheese. No problem. That will do it for us here in Orlando. Game at three tomorrow at 11 a.m. Stay tuned to Huskies All Access uh, for continuing baseball coverage on the website. And if you want, tune in on WHUS for the call tomorrow, 11 a.m. Huskies going for the sweep.